Here we are at Pondville Baptist Church in, in Pondville, Alabama, right outside of Brent. Look at all the smiling faces this time.
It's a song that all of heaven's angels they have no right to see.
How great thou art. Yes, you are, Lord. How great thou art. Then saints, my soul. Good morning. Now, young children, we do penny marks. That's what this little church is for up here. We give the children an opportunity to come through and drop pennies or that silent stuff in. How many children here today? How many children here today? You don't have a mama? How many children here today? Say, I love you, somebody's child, a child of God, or we won't go that way. But normally the little children come and they drop pennies in this up here and, and, and they have more fun doing it than adults ever have. But adults, you get yours ready because we're going to sing a hymn in just a minute. And to close that hymn, we're going to take the offering and give you an opportunity to share. Here's what I'm going to tell you. This is going to be an official Baptist meeting. We're going to take two offerings today. The first one is tithes and offerings. Bring to the storehouse. The second one is for our singers. And that will be at the close after the preaching is done. So we're going to pass it once and that's tithes and offerings. We're going to pass it a second time to share with our singers and we want you to have a part in that. We're glad you have joined us. This is a great day in God's house. We're kind of giving you a little more room. If somebody comes in, these, these uh, other places are, are, are welcome to be taken. We want you to have a good time with us. We've already had a good time. Amen. You weren't here early. We've already had church. Lord's already... Lord's already come in and grabbed a hold of some of us. Gotten a hold of us, but that's what that's why he has us here. So he can get a hold of us. So let's be open to the, to the movement of the Spirit today. We're going to have our opening prayer. Did Miss Jenny what's a hymn number?
and I remember it just like it was yesterday. And one of my favorite songs, been singing it since I was five years old. It's called I'll Have a New Life. <laughs> Yeah. 
listen to the words that Daryl saying. He is a wonderful Savior. Amen. I think it goes like this. Oh, what a Savior.
He, I, he's been down the road on top of this car. He's been down the road on the back of this car. He's been down the road with me on top of this car. <laughs> I've drug him in. I've drug him out. I've picked him up and I've thrown him down. And he tells me he's saved. Just Monday, he was running up and down the road hollering, Kill me, God! Kill me out there! But he says he's saved. I know Jesus. Let me tell you something. Jesus doesn't know him. Yeah. And there's the key. Does Jesus know you? Cade Foster's my friend on Facebook. He's a kicker from the University of Alabama. I saw him today and said, Hey, Cade, this is me, Ray, your friend. He wouldn't no more know me than a man of the money. He doesn't know me. I really don't know him, but I'm friends on Facebook with him. You can say you know the Lord, but it's much better if He knows you because if He doesn't know you, you're not getting in. Yes, sir.